How to measure air pressure of an inflatable using a manometer or magnahelic pressure gauge. You will need the following tools. A manometer or differential pressure gauge, such as a magnahelic pressure gauge. These devices will measure the static pressure in water gauge, WG. The static pressure reading for each inflatable will vary depending on several factors, such as the size of the inflatable, the age of the inflatable, blowers, power source, and if extension cords are being used. Be sure your inflatable is completely inflated and all zippers and drain vents underneath are tightly closed. Ensure you are using the correct size blower for the inflatable and your power source is sufficient for the blowers being used. Unzip one of the deflation zippers just enough to insert the tube inside of the inflatable. Afterward, ensure the zipper and vinyl flap are as tightly closed as possible. This step can be done with a manometer or a magnahelic pressure gauge. Document the reading in your maintenance log and compare with the manufacturer's recommendations for minimum static pressure. You will also want to verify the CFM, cubic feet per minute, of the blower being used to ensure you are getting sufficient output. If the blower's CFM is correct, but the static pressure reading is low, then the issue is one of the following. Air escaping from a flap or zipper, tear, hole, or stitching stretching over time and allowing more air to escape than when the inflatable was brand new. You should not operate the inflatable until the problem has been resolved.